Alright, welcome back to the channel. It is Reactions Rants and Rabbit Holes. I'm old rolling green, and here's the deal. We are here to celebrate Jolly Saint Nick. Middle of the summer. Whoa, you mean midsummer? Midsummer just happened. Ah, uh, I got some comments about the wood and water spirits, and it was interesting. Uh I like some positive ideas based on uh, older ideas, so on and so forth. And Red One here seems right up my alley. And uh, half of me likes to uh, complain about that, say, uh, actors and their side talk and this and that. And honestly, here I'm just, I am a sucker for Christmas. All right. That's when it comes down to it. I'm a sucker for Christmas. I love it. And uh, I like the idea of uh, giving um, goodwill, goodwill in, towards your humankind kind of thing. Now, this appears. I checked out the trailer. It's not a first, it's a second viewing. I uh, sat there slack jawed the first time around going, really? With, with uh, uh, I mean, I think from my personal perspective, a decade of uh, trying to snuff Santa out, I was ready for superhero Santa. Uh, I, I didn't even mind uh, that Silent Night, Deadly Night knockoff or whatever. The, the dude from Stranger Things uh, playing Santa. Uh, a lot of bloodshed in that one. But it had some, some fun moments. I'm actually looking forward to seeing this one. I'm here for the hope that I can get some St. Nick spirit and some action all in the same thing. 497, 498, 499, 500. Let's go heavy. Yeah, got it. Looking strong, Nick. Go on, brush your shoulders off. Red one is on the move. Evening, ladies. What are you so excited about? Of course, your boyfriend's here. Okay. <laughs> okay. Who's with Red? Reach! Someone took Nick. We're gonna find him. I'm bringing in Jack O'Malley. He's probably the best tracker in the world. The guy's a legend. What am I doing here? Last night, Red One, also known as St. Nicholas of Myra, was abducted from the North Pole complex. Are you saying Santa Claus has been kidnapped? Garcia? What the hell? You can't try. Now, when the bear came out, I was like, I gotta do a reaction to this. Uh, and Golden Compass failed. Uh, I don't know. Too complicated, or they, they, changed it too much i don't know but i really wanted to see the bear character in that you know go on to a franchise because you know something about you know what it is one too many jager mr jager might i was a yag or rumple mints rumple mints ads back in the day in a sci-fi magazine with the you know uh, uh an amazingly healthy warrior princess riding some, uh, you know, battle-ready polar bear. And then, you know, the progression to, you know, not a secret furry, but, you know, could get a, you know, do I dig the, the, uh, what is it, anap anapomorphic uh, projection of, you know, our qualities onto the bear? Yeah, that's all right. I was cool with Yogi, too. Has been kidnapped? Garcia? What the hell? You can't trust this guy. He's on the list. You don't mean yes. that list. NL4. Are you telling me this clown is a level four naughty lister? No! A level four naughty lister? Yeah. Oh, is that funny hey, to you? Hey, hey. Yeah, no, see, I, I, it worked. I was like, I, I, all right, I secretly really liked The Rock when he was a wrestler. And I thought, I'm probably positive, I believe I was watching his uh, pre-Hollywood start is the period I, I saw him in because he was doing a lot of lines and a lot less wrestling. And then he, you know, got here in his career. So I think that's how some of that works. And uh, 
Yeah, his delivery's good. Yeah. If they got the charisma to do it in the, 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 the squared circle, they got the charisma to do it on take 36. Uh, green screened CGI uh, bear. And, and if the, the CGI, and if it's good enough, I'm cool. I'm ready. I'm looking forward to it. Bear looks good. Mean. But like, I want to hang out and have drinks with him. I mean, maybe beers with a bear. Slow. I don't want to do shooters. I just, you don't want to piss that bear off. Naughty Lister, a level four Naughty Lister. Yeah, no, but the Naughty Lister, I, I totally, right? I'm, I'm just spending the rest of my uh, breathing uh, days uh, working on, on less, you know, maybe being a level one have made up for level eight Naughty List stuff. Cause it's tough. Yeah, I know it's tough. It's easy to get on that list. Oh, is that funny hey, too? Hey, hey, hey. You're gonna help us find Nick. Wow. Well, I, see, I see the bear do that. So. Grab a car. For what? You don't have a Wonder Woman action figure, do you? It's not how it works. Come on. There is much in here that is not of the natural world. Who's that? Krampus. What are they doing? They're playing crapper slop. I think if you don't need me here, no, I might just go I, back to the car. I hope, in my personal opinion, I hope the slap fest is uh, quicker. Like, like I, I'm pretty sure now I've seen it in the trailer, and it's not my. Hey, no, it might work. Now that nightmare, as a, you know, as a Magic the Gathering player. A nightmare power toughness, I think, equals the number of swamps you control or something like that. And it's like cost five, so whatever. It doesn't like come on. I could be completely wrong. It's been a while since I played black. Uh, but I do have a couple fire red decks right now. But my point is, um, yeah, no, I really, this part sold me. So as much as I was disappointed, not disappointed, but uh, nah, I mean, some parts of the D&D movie just really dragged for me. And I thought were just, you know that hated me but the, the the special effects the ideas the little something something for the old the old school role role playing set because you know it's a it's few and far between where we get something that panders to something we might like it's all got to be you know changed for a modern audience uh but there's better guys that explain in that part to you uh but yeah, no, I was like, what is that? That that thing flaming that dead the horses. Yeah, it's like a, it's like a nightmare. Who's that? Krampus. What are they doing? They're playing crapper slop. I think if you don't Rough. need me here, I might just go back to the car. You gotta we need to prepare for the possibility of no Christmas. No. There's worse ways to go out than trying to save Santa Claus. That, that was the second line. I knew I had to do a reaction to it, whether it worked or not. It could go over to Patreon. I don't care. Uh, because, you know, man, I'm not talking about the commercial, like, you know, corporate uh, intrigue of toy manufacturing and that shit. Uh, the, the spirit of giving and uh, the other side of the whole story. The There is an endless amount of stories about love and Man, it's like the Grinch that stole Christmas and then they sang their Who song. Na, 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 na. And it's like, you know, ripped your heartstrings apart. Why? Because it was the love and the togetherness. It wasn't. It, everything else just added to that, but the other idea was stronger because it it. it brought so many people together for so long they can try to corrupt it but it's like everything else they mostly gotta deceive you into their corruption because when it comes down to it a spirit of goodwill and love and care that shit wins out a lot there's worse ways to go out than trying to save Santa Claus a lot worse ways 
We got snowmen! That was... Well... So disturbing. I don't know. I literally hope that cut is just to subvert my expectations and they show me something a little more disturbing than that because, I don't know, it's a snowman. I don't really put too much faith in him not being able to put himself together. Operating on a fucking sunny tropic beach, on the other hand, make, make no sense. So hopefully they're melting a lot. But I might already be projecting a lot more onto it than I should. At the same time, what is that? Uh, special delivery or what's that one Norwegian Santa Claus crazy where Santa Claus is just like a, he's crazy and he's got like, like elves are, are wicked and ah, oh, what is it? Uh, special delivery, is it special? I don't know. It ended up, the guys who made that ended up going on to make that Sam Jackson where he crashes the, the, the Air Force One and the, he's the president and he crashes and the little Finnish kid out hunting rescues, you know, instead of bringing back the, the trophy that his old man hid for him, he brings back the president, the hero. Yeah, it wasn't all that good, but man, I had to give you some positive vibes. I like positive vibes. And uh, a red one here looks like it might be fun. I like Santa. I don't mind The Rock. And 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 I liked Chris Evans. It, like he's in he's in a lot of cool shit that I like. Even though you know it turns out I probably wouldn't follow him on on Instagram or something. Uh, hmm. Interesting. My turn! Oh my god. Is my face still there? Yeah, yeah, you look good. Uh. I see a man, I would totally. Oh, uh, wait. No, I would. Make this your. Uh, no, I. Hey, you. Ah, hey! Red one, official trailer! Hey, he snucks one in on me. Because uh, updates suck. Uh, as much as losing Santa would suck. I mean, that's not being able to control advertising. But I, you know, I might, I might hold out for that one. I might actually see it now. Man, I hope it doesn't get ruined. Because sometimes you, you get hyped about something and then you realize, no, nope, it wasn't going to be what you thought it was going to be. And now you're sad again. I'm not too sad. That was fun. I didn't mean to lose it, but it's actually complicated to get it back unless I pause and this and that. And I got to go to work. I was just sneaking this in. Red one official trailer. Got to save Santa. All right. Uh, what does it mean? June? Christmas in the end of June. Ah, uh, it's nice. Later. <laughs>